All right. Hello and welcome. Um, I'm back. This time I've got the review of the Black Heimdall. Um, we're up today in 18490 mode. And it's a hard hitting, it's a definitely a hard hitting mod. Um, before going further, I want to thank all my new subscribers and which is basically everyone. Um, yeah, this has been a couple weeks in the work, about a week in the works. So I remember there is the um, contest going on right now on Facebook to win this exact mod. Um, so before we go any further, let's jump down close quickly and take a look at it, shall we? Hello, and as I said, up to the section of the Heimdall, seal number 827. This is going to be the one that I'm giving away on my Facebook profile. So anyway, let's get to it. Um, so here's the box. Comes with the 1862, 18490 slash 500 tube, and 18350 tube. Um, when you get it, the top and bottom cap are going to be on the 18350 tube. Nice packaging. Um, nice solid box. Felt inlays. No problems with it at all. Even kind of like snap shut. It's kind of nice. But that's not what we're here for. We're here for this. The actual Black Heimdall. Um, I got tonight in 500 mode, um, using with my k -fun. Yay, k -fun. Um, so, let's take up two. Mmm, tasty. Um, okay, let's take it off. So, basic mech bag. Um, nothing too fancy with it. Top cap comes off. Battery comes out. Bottom cap comes off. Maybe. Can I get it off? And this is the issue I've had with the Heimdall. There we go. Um, I will say this. I've had an issue. I have had an issue with mine. A um, couple of my friends who have them um, have had the same issue. The switch is horrible. Um, I either personally find it that I can either lock it or get it off my mod. So keep that in mind. Um, it is a thing. So let's take apart this switch. Switchy, switchy, switch. Silver contacts, top, top and bottom contacts. Spring switch, uh, nice vent holes. It is, I believe, brass with that black piano finish. Does not affect how it hits at all. It's a very hard hitting mod. As you can see, Delrin top cap, switch, spring switch, yep, everything. Nothing too major here. If anyone else who is watching this video has any suggestions on how to get that um, lock ring unstuck on this thing, I've tried, I found that I can either get it unlocked or I get it off the mod itself. And I tend to just let it so I can get off the mod so I can switch tubes and just lay it on inside. Personally, that's how I use it. All right, so let's switch back on here. One nice thing about this thing, um, nice, can either be considered nice or could considered be a issue. Put the battery in there. It is a floating 510 and an adjustable 510. What I mean by that is, watch as I screw it, screw my K fun in. You can see that silver coming out. Nice and snug. Put it on. Back together. The threads on this thing are very thin. Um, nice though, not crunchy. Everything threads together really well. It's a very well done mech mod. Um, the logo itself, it actually does say Heimdall. 
right there in that little winged creature thing that they have there. Um, seal number right underneath, seal number 827. And that's pretty much it for the up close section. That is the Black Heimdall. All right, so that was it up close and personal. Um, it's still rocking with my k -fun. I like this mod. Um, especially in 18.490 mode, throw my k -fun on there. Can throw it in my purse, don't really have to worry about it too much. Um, I wish the threads were a little bit thicker um, so I don't have that issue with that locking ring. Um, it's been really been my only complaint about it. Uh, the only other thing is on like on the 18652 tube, the serial number itself looks a little bit worn. Um, but I've used the 18652 tube a lot more with it since so I've gotten it. So, mm. such a good vape. Um, vaping Dead Man's Party by the standard right now in here. Such a taste. That blueberry lemonade is just wonderful. Um, especially out of a K-Fun. And we need to fill it up again tonight. Um, but yeah, anyway, thank you everyone for subscribing. Um, I got, oh, before going further, I got this one from Blow No Smoke. Um, yes, I work there. Um, I paid two, they were selling them for, we, are sell, we were selling them for $230. They are no longer in stock anymore at Blow No. Um, we, I'm not sure where to find them online. I, if I find another place to buy the authentic like this online, I will post it down below. Um, and anyway, thank you for subscribing. Make sure to like my page, make sure to subscribe to me on Facebook and make sure to enter that contest for who is going to win this exact mod. And anyway, thank you for watching. Have a great day. Remember to keep on vaping.